Welcome back to 2014. There's been a lot of games we missed because of snow dates, but we're getting a couple in in a row. There's a Wednesday and a Thursday night. It was Miller Group and the Glaciers against Team Schleitz. And we went 1-1 one -one on the uh, two-game affair over the two nights. You can see Glenn here on the static cam making some saves in the first. Glacier's off to a quick 1-0 lead, but we would not let them hold on to that lead. With Thomas said he poking people back on D. Getting down, blocking passes, doing what he can to protect Quagmire and Net. Some big saves, too, late in the first period. Uh, we think we were, yeah, we're still down 1-0 here a couple minutes in, but now we move into the second and we start putting some goals on the board. Nice pass from Skid Marks to the new guy, Eric. We're going to call him Eric the Great because you're going to see him put some goals in in a few minutes. Kyle finishes that off. It's about it's good timing for Kyle there. 1-1, one, one, and then Eric the Great takes over. He's coming in. He's going around one person, and he's hitting that short side blocker, it looks like. That's one. And you're going to witness a natural hat trick here. Here's number two. Also in, nice screen by Kyle. Gets the goalie off, off his kilter there. It's two goals in a row. Then uh, Spanky comes in, almost almost puts that home. Seconds later, it was already yeah, it was already 3-2. Again, Eric the Great to the left, to the left, and five hole. And it's 4-2. There's the natural hat, and he almost got four in a row, as you'll see right here. He gets a break, beats somebody. And gets in and almost puts that in. Nice save by the goalie. I think that might have gone had the goalie not got a glove on it. So it's 5-3. And we move into the third period. And you're going to see going to make some stops. Because this game, this game is going to go to Schultz. All the time say does get walked there. But it was late. I think it was already like 7-3 at that point. So it ends up being 7-4. And I grabbed the cam on the net to grab the last 10 seconds. But uh, Glacier's looking like they're probably going to be third or fourth. Schlitz is fighting for second or third. And uh, Miller Group got the bye. But the Glaciers do not answer Team Schlitz this game. So it's 7-4 Schlitz. So we move on to the Miller Group game. And the ice was a little slippery tonight. I'm down there. Uh, we're going to take each other out on this play as well. And then the guy at Miller Group with the one-timer also goes down. I don't know. <laughs> we, we hadn't been back for a while. Then some snow days and some games off. So Skidmark's going to walk through everybody, though, and put that home. It's one nothing. Schlitz. Miller Group's got the best record in the league. They're up from the B League last year and putting together a team that has been doing quite well in the A League. I'm going to get a sneaky one out of frame there. It's 2 nothing Team Schlitz. I think that was a pass from either Spanky or Skidmark's. I'm not sure. And then more, more face plants. The rest of the game happened to go to Miller Group, unfortunately. We got a little too comfortable with our 2 nothing lead and pick up people in front of the net. We had Saluski in from out of town, Stevie KY in from Japan, and uh, I don't know. We just we didn't pick them up in our end the way we should have, and we didn't convert on some opportunities later in the game here. And the game goes from 2 1 to 2. Look at that. Skid Marks just misses that up top. And then we keep the pressure on. We had some decent pressure in this game, but didn't get the goals we needed. Saluski in from Philly, holding the line at the boards, getting that across. Kyle lets a rifle goal. He's not happy. I'm put that on Facebook because that was a nice save. But Miller Group was a nice shot. The camera, that's why I put it on Facebook. So uh, then, then things all just kind of fell apart. We just got beat. Coming back. We got a back check against the team. Team Schlitz a different team in the playoffs. Like, look at this. Right off the ensuing faceoff off that other goal. Stevie KY, they get the two on two turns into a two on zero, oh, and then it's like four two or five two, and Herms gets pissed off, so he starts slew footing people and pulling people down. I don't know, like I feel like I fell down. Nobody could stand up on this game anyway. Todd, look at that four check coming in, gets forces wide, and then makes love to the goal post, but weren't able to put the goals in when we needed to, so this game kind of got out of hand later. Here in the third, look at this. Two on ones, we're not getting back. We got to take that get physical. This will not be accepted in the playoffs. Everyone's hustling back. They'll be back checking all over the place. Look at this. We get laid out in, our, in their end there. No call, and they come back uh, out of the zone and put this home. Watch this. A lot of the guys go into the backhand. So we know now they have the European high backhand on the break. So we'll, we'll, Glenn, I'm sure we'll watch that in the playoffs if we see them again, which we probably will. And then, ugh, and then that's it. Yep, we kind of gave up at that point. So, yeah, look at this guy. Catch that number between the legs with a 7-2 game. Let's, uh, let's remember that for next time. 
But we did get one late. Let's keep this keep the puck in. We can two can play at this game. No back check in. Kyle and Spank is gonna put that home. So Team Schlitz will get him later in the playoffs, boys. They're